Right. Hey, everybody. Um, hey, everybody. It's great to um, introduce today my friend, Diane Adams. Uh, we are trying something new at First Baptist to help us during the pandemic to get to know more people, or maybe get to know a little bit more about people that we see at church. Um, and so we're calling this our Sacred Partners Spotlight. And Diane is our first guinea pig. So I'm, I asked her to uh, let me ask her a few questions. And the goal is just is just to have a good time and to get to know each other a little bit in maybe ways that we didn't know before. And so Diane, thank you for helping me out. You're welcome. So uh, where are you originally from? Gainesville, Florida. Would you go to, go to Gainesville High School? I did. Went to Gainesville High School, went to Santa Fe College the first year it opened, and then University of Florida. All right. Now, um, you were married to Tim. Is that right? That's right. Um, where Where did you and Tim meet? We met at Glen Springs Elementary School where I was teaching on the playground. <laughs> he came up to me one day, scared me. <laughs> <laughs> so very unexpected and uh, asked me to go out with him and uh i had a boyfriend at the time named jim so okay <laughs> i told him no but i also said ask me again and i don't know where that came from <laughs> oh that's great was yeah, he so was he a teacher was he were y'all on the same teaching staff he was majoring in health and physical education and they had to do a short internship in an elementary school and he ended up in the classroom right next to mine so you are so you were already teaching and he was still in the he and so he was still in uh at college that's right i've been teaching about two years okay and um tell me about your other parts of your family i have two brothers uh my younger brother mike lives in melrose and my older brother, Gary, lives in Columbus, Ohio. Okay, and children? Your um, children? We had one daughter, Emily. Emily, and she's, I wanna say Wisconsin, is that right? That's correct, she is in Wisconsin, freezing up there in the winter. And you have a chance now to be as um, prideful as you want to be about your grandkids. Tell me about your grandkids. Okay, that's easy. Uh, Alice is seven and she is uh, very fun and active and never stops talking, just really cute. Um, she looks just like my daughter Emily did, exactly. And then Timmy is four and uh, his he's named after my husband. His name is Timothy James and um, he's just so much fun, so much fun. That's wonderful. And any idea when in the pandemic world you might be able to see it, see them all again? Well, we all have airline tickets that we had uh, planned to use. So as soon as it feels safe, either way, they'll either come here or I'll go there. Well, I'm looking forward to this. Y'all can get together soon. So yeah, but we FaceTime a, a lot, a whole lot. Very good. And I see you've been, how long have you been part of First Baptist? I was on the cradle roll since, so since I was a little baby. <laughs> so 29 years. 29 years. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, and so um, what do you love? One of the things I, I love is you, as often on Facebook, you'll say something like, I love my church. Uh, and I love that. What do you love about First Baptist? Well, I guess uh, first would be the people, you know, just so many people that I've met through the years that have come and gone and been involved in my family's life and my life. I have lifelong friends there that I've known since, you know, years ago. And um, it's always just been a constant. It's always been there. And, um, you know, through hard times and uh, and wonderful times, it's, it's just, a place to go and feel loved and, and love other people. Okay. It's, a, it's a great church and I'm grateful for your presence. And you teach um, uh, a Sunday school class and y'all are still, y'all do y'all still meet um, on Zoom? We are meeting, we are. Um, we meet once a week. Okay. And um, what, um, 
uh, was it a, I, I don't quite know how to use it. Young, how do you describe your class? Who, who, all, who, all, who, who all could come to your class? Well, I, I think anybody can really come. When we started, they called us Young Career. <laughs> and um, that's kind of how we started. And it, it's mostly been young people, but um, th there's uh, another person in there that's a uh, little bit younger than me. So, and then we've had some uh, mostly women, but we have had some young men come through that have moved to different states now. Um, but we always felt like it was open to anybody. So if you're looking for a, um, a Bible study class that meets at just a really great community, and um, I know Diane would love to, for, all, for you to be a part of that. So Diane, thank you so much for letting us get to know you a little bit better today. Sure, enjoyed it. Anything else I didn't ask that you want to say? Um... I don't think so. Just invite everybody to come to church. It was great to see you in church on Sunday. I was, I was so great that, that you have, you felt comfortable enough to do it and uh, look forward to um, seeing you again there soon. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Me, all right. Let me.